National Instruments has partnered with Formula Student for more than a decade and is passionate about inspiring the next generation of engineers. It's really good for real engineering experience. A lot of university life, you sort of, you're in lectures all the time and it's, it's not really how real industry works. There's probably about 120 teams here today and I'd estimate that maybe up to 30 of them have been using National Instruments technology either in the lab, uh, on the bench or today have it in the car doing some form of measurement or control. There are many UK universities here and it's a great opportunity to have a dialogue with them but also universities from around the globe, uh, many universities from Europe and as far afield as India or the US are here so yeah it's a great international event. It's a battery electric car in Class 1A. The control systems use National Instruments equipment, so we started off with a compact Rio, um, and now we've moved on to a single board Rio that we've packaged ourselves. It does all the control of the car, so the ignition sequence, it does the whole drive loop, so it takes signals from the pedal box, outputs that to the controllers. Uh, it monitors the battery health, and it also uh, logs data for us so when we go testing we can go back and analyse the performance of the car. We're running car 31 and we'll be entering it in the class 1 entry so it's a, it's a petrol powered car. We use a, a full aluminium honeycomb monocoque and an Aprilia V-twin 550cc engine. National Instruments supports Formula Student teams with system design software, measurement and control hardware and on-campus engineering time. This year the, we've used the Compact Rio quite extensively um, in our dynamometer setup and in dynamic testing. We were monitoring the chassis panel temperature um, while the car was going around the track rather than just on, on a stationary rig. Um, and then in addition to the, the temperatures we were also logging the stresses that were coming from the, the suspension push rods through strain gauges. If you were making your own ECU for the car you'd have to do, you'd have to remake one if it was a quite a big change but with the SB Rio you can just reprogram it and then it compile in an hour and you can be driving the car again. If you had to make something from scratch it would be few people fully on that for a year I think as a project whereas I could just pick it up and we could have the car running within a month. I found it to be incredibly intuitive. I mean, I'm a mechanical engineer at heart and I'd never touched programming before LabVIEW and I picked it up very, very quickly. The programs that we used to, to log the data this year, I think it took me half a day to write both of them. So, I mean, that, that just speaks volumes. Some of the other guys that I'm friends with in uni, they did projects where they had to code on picks and they spent more time correcting things because of various you know, compatibility issues. But with the NI stuff, the integration was perfect. It was phenomenally easy and it produced fantastic results. Visit uk.ni.com slash formula student to learn more about how FS teams are using NI tools and to get engineering support for your car.